the one and two. So he starts like, see, he choked a bit and he has to focus because John White wants something now. He, this thing is he wants to win. He's, so the, he's like a machine gun now. Yeah, so far up the court. Oh. Greg letting it go by there on characteristic. John I think John deserves to win this point, but I don't know what's going to happen. <laughs> he's got Greg going every which way. <laughs> but as we've seen, nice drive. Deserves and and, and getting is is two different things. Yeah. Oh, it looks like John is really tired now, and he's trying to look for a winner. Praying and for that winner. And what's going to happen? Nice drive, boast. Just stay any way he can. Flick. Ooh. He wants a let probably now. He can't oh. move. He's definitely struggling here. John he broke the record. Not happy with that one. Yeah, I think it's I giving think it's uh, Greg working hard and deservedly getting match ball here. Here we go. One more rally to take it to a tiebreak situation. I'm sure. The only thing I don't want it to happen is that John hit the tin because he won't be very happy <laughs> with this. Well, we'll all hear about it. There it is, oh! folks. We got a 10 all situation <laughs> from 5 10 down. John White comes back to a tiebreaker. Look at that. You can see on Greg's face his own disbelief. Yeah, Shabana's playing a really good game now. He's, he's definitely in the ascendancy here. Oh, oh, nice. Death touch there. Fantastic wrist. Hand out, five all. Now, as we are in Chicago, I don't see many Americans in this draw, Simon. Is there a, is there a specific reason for that? Um, it's, it's just uh, not a lot of the um, American men are that high, highly ranked at this stage. Um, Julian, Illing, Julian Illingworth was in the draw. He's improved a lot. He's been working uh, with David Pearson, uh, the English national coach, in Harrogate for the summer in England, and he's and it's paid off. He he's had some good wins, and he qualified for the for the main draw. So um, great for American squash. Yeah, and um, I I for one would like to see more Americans getting up there. And, you know, I'm sure Americans would give their support and and that would help squash overall. Uh, that's, a, that's a fantastic hold. James severely frustrated with himself. He's just incredibly determined this week. I think uh, the, the win over Palmer was a big breakthrough. In, uh, for personal reasons, he hasn't actually ever beaten Palmer in PSA until yesterday. Oh, he's taking it in again. Oh, oh, he's got it. Oh, what did you get <laughs> unbelievable squash. <laughs> oh, this is incredible. That means oh, he's down. Is it down? It looked like it deviated. What an amazing rally. It's fantastic. Oh. Full length dive from Rami into the back. Back will boast. People in the front row look as if, oh, I mean, I'd be jumping off my seat out. there. Yeah, it's been going good now. I mean, you know, from five, six players in top 20, so it's not bad.
nice testing rallies and yeah. our best of the great drop from the back. Try from James. I thought he's going to leave it when he played that really lazy lob, but he kept Abbas didn't play that deep to the back, and James got to it and won the point. Um, frustrating and starts shooting too much from the back of the court when he's playing the likes of Pete Nichol, who was going deep, right, and it right. made him change his game a little bit at the moment. Right. Very much in his comfort zone. Unfortunately, it's not uh, not El Hindi's game or nature to play that style of game either. He's a bit of a uh, like that. What a great get! Incredible pickup from Thierry. Great pickup. All in vain. Unfortunately, was El Hindi won the point, but that was you know, Thierry's fast. Power, please. Power, it please. Looks like it may have. Um, Not sure what that tattoo on El Hindi's arm says, but uh, it might be something like "I'm not moving." Again, <laughs> <laughs> good lifting from the Egyptian. El Hindi, based in Cairo, has been training a lot, actually in England recently, with uh, Jonah Barrington, former world number one and six-time British Open champion. Great volley drop from Lukey there. So Hindi flicked up a loose backhand and Linky took advantage of it and just put it down into the neck. Yeah, Linky's playing his classic game. He's being pretty patient. He's so far up on that tee, isn't he? Yeah. I think he's one of the players. He's, he's really up on that tee more than anyone. Yeah, definitely. And oh yeah, there, there it was. You know, he literally took that in front of the half court line, and you know, Rami in the back corner had literally no chance. Right side. Six, a couple seven. of those volley drops now for clean winners. Again, very ferocious pace. Guys are really they're volleying everything. Trying to cut that ball off. Rami there, he's showing how good his hands are, you know. He's just cutting every single ball out. He's answering every question that Thierry's asking. It's like a big cat, isn't he, waiting to pounce on that thing. Oh. Just cut that into the neck. That Classic was Rami there. It's an amazing shot. Left side. Left side. Five.